Yeah, I'm here to present my uh, new album, Bayati. I'm happy. <laughs> I'm glad to, uh, to see this album that it's, uh, it's released recently. And um, I hope that, uh, that uh, listeners, jazz lovers, will, will, uh, will enjoy it. Bayati is um, uh, there's there's some uh, some meanings, not just one meaning. Uh, one of them is uh, <coughs> we have traditional Azerbaijan uh, music style. It's uh, it's a property like of Azerbaijan people. It's a very old traditional music called mugam, and uh, there is seven um, main mugams, and one of them Bayati Shiraz. This two words like Bayati Shiraz and the first is Bayati and the, and the second meaning is the, this old Azerbaijan poem style so it's, it, uh, it belongs to old Azerbaijan tradition Yeah, of course, the first, it was her father, Wagif Mustafa Zadeh, and uh, he, 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 was, he was the first who, who played, who played, he pl who played like, it was Soviet Union time, you know, <laughs> it was a difficult, difficult time, so uh, it was difficult to that time uh, to play jazz, but uh, he was, he was amazing, but uh, and, uh, he, he died 39 years, when he was 39 years old by a heart attack. And uh, he made, he was a founder of this uh, jazz um, Mugam style or something like this. And uh, then his daughter uh, Aziza uh, became uh, famous of the world. Uh, and um, she, she uh, had uh, recordings with some very famous musicians in the world. So, of course, now we, we, do, we do jazz, we play. Of course, uh, Azerbaijan has, I think, very good traditional jazz. Jazz music, and it started. It started after ten years. It came to the world to, to American jazz. Like we have, yeah, we have about, about I don't know, ninety years <laughs> jazz traditional music. We had uh, orchestras, uh, jazz orchestras in nineteen thirties, nineteen forties, yeah. And uh, it, was, it was difficult time, but of course, it it, it, it sounds very good. <laughs> it sounds very good. I had a lot of tunes inside this album, of course. Just uh, when thinking about the album, uh, and we, we recorded not only this, uh, we recorded about um, maybe two times more <laughs> in, in the studio in London. But then uh, we just we just uh, we just chose them like listening. So what the better, what's uh, good for album, or the not not too long, uh, and uh, and uh, I did. Yeah, I I was. Uh, yeah, it was interesting to work on to to work on Chopin Prelude. Prelude yeah, to to play like first and like uh, like as to be like classical. He wrote it, and uh, then to uh, to improvise on it, to improvise on these harmonies, and uh, yeah, it was interesting.
yeah, of course, yeah, this is this is great, great musicians, really, I love them. This is um, the bass player I played last 10 years, and uh, Nathan Peck, so they're from New York, both, and uh, Nathan Peck is, uh, and the uh, drums player, Ari Hoenig, we play about maybe two years, um, and uh, he is also very professional musicians. Very, so uh, I feel on the stage when I play, you know, and uh, I always tell them that, of course, I sometimes play with uh, other musicians too. But um, when I when I'm with this trio, when I'm with, the, with these guys, it's it's amazing. I, I I don't I don't feel I don't feel any any hole. You know, we're listening to each other, and it's I love I love I love them. These good musicians. These very great musicians. Yeah. This is such a difficult question. <laughs> um, a lot of great albums, a lot of great musicians in the world, but uh, maybe Kit Jarrett's belonging. <laughs> yeah, it's maybe it's a great album. If if something beautiful, if any music is beautiful, it's the important thing is to be the beauty. I mean, in the music, in the music, yeah, it it it, it, uh, it can be not class. It can be classical. It can be jazz or anything. If it's beautiful, it's it's okay. It's it's great. So I I can listen to it. I can enjoy it. I always practice. I always practice. I always play music when when I have gigs or I don't have gigs. I'm always, f I'm always looking for, uh, looking for music, looking for um, interesting things, and in in the, I'm looking for everything. In the, when, when playing, when I want to find something interesting things in classical, in jazz, in tunes, and everywhere. So it's it's always in progress. It's always in progress. Yeah, I can't say that. Yesterday I found something, or I will find it tomorrow. It sometimes comes to me like when when uh, working when working progress. <coughs> I can't say what's exactly. Mm -hmm. 